Oscar talk. Yes. Yeah. Mm. Host talk. Uh, Amanda joins us this morning. Man, tough gig. It is a tough now, gig. Uh, now, first of all, Amanda and I, we almost never disagree on anything. I don't care if the Oscars have a host. I'm perfectly fine with them being you hostless. You like hostless. I'm fine with hostless, but Amanda, Tony, Amanda does not. Wow, no. <laughs> you don't even watch. That's, that's why I like hostless. Fair point. Fair point. <laughs> wow. If you don't watch, you don't get a vote. That's true, Tony. <laughs> We rarely disagree. Our favorite genre of film. We like scary movies. But yeah, I think mean. it's scary yeah. when the Oscars don't have a host. Okay? <laughs> so we I'm so glad that they came back. But this is interesting because the Oscars are making history and also making up for going three years without a host, which are three of Tony's favorite Oscars, probably. <laughs> but they're coming back with once, twice, three times the ladies. That's right. Oh, hello. We are getting confirmation this morning. They even tweeted it out. The Academy just confirmed the reports that Amy Schumer, Regina Hall, and Wanda Sykes are all on board to host the 94th Academy Awards. It's a three-hour broadcast, so each host will MC one hour. So Wanda will have an hour. Mm. Amy will have an hour. Regina will have an hour. Yeah. So that'll it'll be interesting. You know, last year, the Academy ditched the Kodak Theater in favor of a more intimate setting, and viewership really did suffer as a result. It was the lowest rated Oscars in mm. history since they started a broadcast in the 50s. But here's, here's the one sigh for me. Deadline points out that the move follows a series of apparent rejections from them wanting different hosts. Quote, the Academy first approached Dwayne Johnson, a host who took a pass, Ooh. and treaties to tandems like Pete Davidson and John Mulaney and Steve Martin and Martin Short also fell short. They didn't work out. So I guess the sigh is I, I don't like that the women were the the second choice, choice if those you. reports are true <laughs> right mm -hmm. exactly mm -hmm. if those reports are in fact true that they made first asks to the rock and the other gentlemen but nonetheless we as women take the win right we yeah. have three ladies the in win. the spotlight for the oscars They're about six weeks away and what do you think tony will you be watching this year with the three ladies I, you know you still I, are... I, I may i have to support the ladies because first of all i love all three of them but i yeah. really love wanda yeah. sykes i am a huge wanda oh, sykes she's fan so funny yeah. Amanda, so, he, he won't buddy, be watching, you know, but you can fill us in the next morning. <laughs> I, <laughs> I will definitely fill you in. Listen, I've interviewed these women, and let me just tell you, they it's like they always have a camera on. Wanda Sykes, if you've ever seen Wanda Sykes on a red carpet, she is on from the minute she arrives to the minute she leaves. So I feel that you're right, Tony. She will not disappoint in her uh, Yeah, I think, I think she'll knock it out of the park. Okay, uh, Amanda, thanks so much. Of course, we'll see you a little bit later on.